She's 11 years old mm. and they've done every shot twice. She has an earpiece in. Could you imagine saying half of these lines to mm. no face? I know she had a double in yeah. for a lot of it, but for a lot of it, she's just saying it to no, she's just saying yeah. it to dinner. In two mm. accents, which neither really drops yeah. while she's playing the characters. And this is the inception of Lindsay. And I think this is actually a good reason why we like it so much because I think this movie came out in 1998. Mm. We were born that year. Mm. Mm. By the time we probably watched this and were cognizant, of what we were watching, Lindsay Lohan was defining teenage dirtbag. She was yeah. it in the 2000s alongside yeah. Confe- Paris Hilton and Britney. Confessions of a drama holic. Or yeah. Confessions of a drama holic. She girls. was she was in rehab. She was in jail. She had mug shots. Mm. She was partying with Paris Hilton. They were the it girls. They were defining social media. Mm. Mm. It has cross generational appeal. Also to our 100%. parents who love Natasha Richardson and Dennis Quaid. I would say all of us feel like we grew up with her. I just feel like she was so perfect. It's objectively bizarre that they split the twins up. Like that that uh, was the yeah. decision made. They Did they flip a met. coin? Yeah. Did they just grab the who kid that was who? closest to, to you? And what judge yeah. signed off on this? Yeah. yeah. Would they be in jail if it happened? Yeah. Also 11 <laughs> years never meeting. And never needing once to speak. Like one kid didn't have an accident in one yeah. moment that, where they didn't feel the need to be like, oh, you know, yeah. hey Liz, don't, yeah. you know. Ali <laughs> broke her leg. Ali's needs but a she's kidney, all good. you know. <laughs> <laughs> That is Reckon so true. Reckon Annie could give one. Like that is so true. No lonely moments where they thought, "Hey, I'm gonna call my kid." That's in America, <laughs> across oh, the Atlantic. I, I was Ocean. just thinking that. Like, I wonder how yeah. they're going. They're in like what the fifth grade, probably eleven. The, yeah, yeah. Fifth grade. So would they not be like, "Oh, I want to see like how she's doing," or like, "Oh my god, that's." Who I think is an underestimated character. Who? Martin. There is a short scene, five <laughs> seconds long. Here we go. Which shows. A woman playing the bugle. A young adult. Oh, a young woman. <laughs> into, the, into the microphone. Into the microphone. Like so aggressively. It's like, it sounds like some sort of Anzac Day memorial song. Yeah. It's also nostalgic because it reminds me of Anzac Day at school mm. where you'd have someone playing the bugle or yeah. the trumpet and they couldn't quite get the notes out. Yeah. But what was funny is when I was watching this, the subtitles were on. And what they called that trumpet player and the sound was off-key bugle girl. No, oh. no way. <laughs> Best Supporting oh, yeah. Actress Award. <laughs> of I think she was nominated. That there was a lack of duty of care at this camp. <laughs> <laughs> Exhibit A. The isolation cabin. Yeah. First of all, she says off to the isolation cabin. She gets the entire camp <laughs> to, march. to march left, right, left, right to marching band music <laughs> to the isolation cabin only to tell them, all right, girls, back to your activities. Yeah. Run back and through the forest. Yeah. And then they send them to this isolation cabin. No duty of care would allow None. someone to put two people who hate each other, who they don't know who anything about them, could potentially be mm. murderous in the same cabin in the middle of the woods. Are they baiting them? Yeah, but that's... The- <laughs> <laughs> baiting? <laughs> There's no electricity. There's, it's like leaking. They're Leaving the them to the their woods. own devices. But it's the classic setup. It's the it setup it's, that it's they, yeah. they need. actual reveal of Meredith to Annie. Is it through the paparazzi lens? Yes, and you see her hat covering her face and she just like slowly tilts up and then she's like, hi. And it's like, oh my God. Mm. Like, In imagine being bridegroom hat. And imagine being Elaine Hendricks and having to do that. Or imagine that happening in real life. <laughs> yes. You meet your dad's fiance and she just doesn't look up for like a good minute while you're talking to your dad. <laughs> yeah, so true. <laughs> Hey. So true. <laughs> Everything she does, it's but so... like, even just the way she like pulls her car up and like doesn't park it properly and just like no. you know, or like yes. rings that little bell. Everything about her is just so. Oh.